In only his first appearance at the event, Danish bowler Frederick Orgard went on to clinch the Men's Open champion trophy, defeating his main challenger, Qatari Youssef Aljaber, 502 to 478. The Dane was pleased with his bowling on the day, which resulted in his first international title outside Europe. It was, yeah, it was actually, I had a tough beginning, but I started to, uh, to hold down the, you could say, my nerves, and uh, I was quite confident uh, afterwards, after a tough start, and then I started to bowl really good, and then here in the semi semi-finals and the finals, I played fantastic. The champion narrowly edged Swede Pontus Andersen in the first match of the Step 4 final to advance, while his finals opponent, Yusuf, defeated 2015 Kuwait Open champion Brad Angelo of the US in the other match. Angelo then defeated Anderson 452 to 432 in the third and fourth playoff to finish a second runner-up. Bowled pretty well today. Um, it was a very difficult field of people. Uh, the other competitors were, were all very, very good as well. But fortunately, I, I made it through the qualifying and uh, uh, and then I bowled Yusuf from Qatar, and he bowled great. Um, he had a very good reaction and, and made many great shots, and so he deserved to win that match. In the women's action, Egypt's Sarah Gamal was no match for Sweden's Jolene Persson playing Fox, winning 433 to 399 in the two games championship match. I am so happy with my performance. This is the first time for me I have played against a professional competitor, but I did it well and I won the title. My competitor is a world champion. She is the runner-up in the World Cup. I am happy with my success. This marked the 17th edition of the Sinai International Open Bowling Tournament. Mahia Mutua, CCTV.